Hello everybody, it's Gabby Wonders, back with another video. Today's video is a fabric haul for you guys. Um, I went to Joann's and I recommend everybody do this before the 16th of August because that's when it ends. Uh, if you can sew or you can no sew, you know, with the iron-on stuff and whatnot. Or if you just need fleece in general. Um, they have 70% off of their fleece. Some of them will double up like one of the Joann's that I went to did. And I'm going to explain to you now. So one of them in Middleton, Massachusetts, um, which is where I went to get some of these, and then I went to Saugus, Mass to get the rest. You can get them, not only do you get them for 70% off, they then 50% off that. So these were only $1.50. And I spent $8 on four remnants, and I'll show you the remnants before I show you the others. So this one is just a navy blue with a sky blue, a white, and some gray dots on it. And this was like $1.50. And you can see the original pricing on there. The next one that I got, and it's only blizzard fleeces, by the way, guys, not anti pill, unfortunately. This one was also $1.50. And you can see the original price on there. It might have been, that one was $1.39, and I think this was $1.50. And you can see how much of it, that's how much I got. That's the original price. And then they do 70% off and then 50% off. So, and this is really cute. I needed to get more fleece for the boys because the girls have um, three liners, three cage liners that I made. Well, I made two of them and I bought one from Picky Pop Shop. So I needed to get some more so I could make some for the boys. I just went out and bought U-Haul as well. Or, well, not yet. I'm going to actually. I just thought of that. So this is really, really cute. It's orange, like a lightish blue, light blue with chevron, orange with chevron, just plain white. Then I got this one also for the girls, um, because those are for the boys. And you can see the original price, and I only paid $1.39 for this. Um, and it's really cute. It matches, like, their cupcake print, and then on the other side of the cupcake print, uh, liner that I made, I had, like, the zigzag with polka dots. So I figured I'd get this, because I really like these colors together. I just absolutely adore them. There you go. Let me grab the other remnant. And this is the last remnant that I got. And I, I love this. I know it's kind of hard to tell. And I tried to pull it out a little bit before. But it's this cute little dinosaur. And it's got little specks on it. And I think it's so freaking adorable. So you can just see the dinosaur in there. And you can see the original price. And this was $1.50. So it was originally $12.49 for a yard and a quarter. And I just absolutely adore this so much. I don't know why I just do. These ones were, oops, sorry about that, on the roll fleece. So I picked up the frog one. I'm trying to do this without making a giant mess. And I picked up a yard of this. And I, I just think it's so cute. I don't know why, I just absolutely love this. And what I'm thinking of doing is making a double-sided fleece with this one. So one week they can have this side, then I wash it, and then I put this side up. Um, because they kind of go together because of the green, but not like terribly much so. So it won't look terrible, terrible, but I haven't decided about it yet. So I love this. I don't know, it's just super cute. I got a yard of this. And you'd think that I could fold it, but not very well with one hand, unfortunately. I don't know. I'll deal with this after. I'm just going to attempt to fold this here a little bit because, yeah. Then I got this really, really cute panda print. And Jessica of the Cabbie House has this, and I keep telling her how much I love it. And I decided I'd go and pick some of this up and potentially match these together so one side is this and one side is that haven't decided yet though but I mean look at this it's too cute too cute so let me move that and the last thing that I got was the nautical anchor one um and I, when I when I got this I was um thinking of um sorry my mom was yelling Stephanie of Sherwood small pets so I think my boys will really like this. Nautical stuff, I mean, it's cute, but I don't really think much of it since 
I live in the oldest seaport in America. So it's like I live on the water. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but you can see the water there. Right there. I live on the ocean. So, I mean, I don't know. I don't think much of this stuff. I mean, I, I think this is absolutely just to die for. Adorable. Cute. Absolutely fabulous in every way. And I think that it really does justice for the anchors and just the idea of nautical stuff in general. So, I figured I might as well pick this up while I was out. And I got a yard and a half of this one um, because I couldn't remember while I was out because this is the next day how much of this one I had gotten because I'm doing one side of it in the nautical and one side in this because they match perfectly. So I'm 100% positive I'm going to do that. And since I'll have a little bit of extra of this one, I might make a corner fleece thingy, the fleece forest. Um, or I just might make a little bit of a lap pad. I'm thinking of just doing two lap pads because I'll have a quarter yard left, I think. Yeah, yeah, I'll have a little bit more than a quarter of a yard left. So I might be able to make two or three lap pads with this or just pee pads to go under the bed or on the bed or whatever. Um, so I haven't decided yet, but yeah, so I might start selling cozy items, but because I'm not very good with PayPal and stuff like that, I'd really, to be honest, and I know a lot of people don't feel comfortable doing this, I only think I'll accept money orders and checks, um, I guess cash too, I don't know how that works if people feel comfortable with cash, um, but... I mean, I'm not really too incredibly, in, like, you know, it's not important that I make things to sell them. So if somebody doesn't really want to pay other than PayPal, it doesn't really make a difference to me if I'm making something for them or not. Because, I mean, I, I'm not doing this to make money. I'm just doing it just because, I guess. Um, so the fleece is really cheap this time around for me. So, I might make some lap pads, some uh, 12 by 12 lap pads and sell them for like $6 each or $5 each, I don't know. I think $5 each is a fair price for a 12 by 12 or 14 by 14. Yeah, I think 14 by 14. I'm trying to think. Yeah. Yeah. And I might do, do it that way. Um... Or I could do the circle ones that go inside of the cages, the, the huts that people get. Um, yeah, I don't think I'd be able to do much else because I'm not very talented. Just pretty much lap pads and drip pads and fleece forests and fleece ball, the little ruffly balls. I think those are all I'm really good at. Um, so, I mean, just look at all these fleeces. And I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to go to Joanne's again tonight to the other one where I got these ones and try to get some more of them at this cheap price because I can make pajama pants with these and I can make regular blankets. I make baby blankets, which I do for my friends um, who've had babies. Um, I can make cozy sacks. That's what I can make. That's what I know how to make. I know how to make cuddle, not cuddle cups, um... You know what, I can't think of what they're called. Just the little caves, I guess, the little things you go in, the little sacks. So yeah, anyway, thanks for listening to me rant about how awesome these cute fabrics are and how much I am in love with them. Um, so, guess who's happy camper right now? This girl right here. Let's go take a peek at my girls. Anyway, other than me ranting. The boys are sitting on their ramp because I put treats on there. And up boys! These girls are chewing on the Hop Nibble Squeak cupcake. You can kind of tell they've been ripping it up. Which makes me really sad. They had a little bit of a chomp on this. A little bit of a chomp on this. I don't... They had another pink popsicle. A little bit of a chomp on that. That's what they've been doing with all of their chew toys. But yeah, thanks for watching.